See, listen, see, because we're, like, we're using Skype, uh-huh. and you don't listen to a lot of podcasts or that, but see, all the folk that use Skype, uh-huh. they don't sit and try to work out the quality, like like we just done before we started recording. Like, they'll have it so it just sounds like a telephone. That's bad. Well, you get, like, professional podcasts, and, and they're like, eh, uh, oh, such and such for, like, say it's a gaming one, right? They'll have, oh, somebody for Activision. Uh, we spoke to her the other day, and this is what they have to say about X game that's coming out. Mm-hmm. And obviously they spoke to them on Skype, because fucking, they're not going to get their phone numbers, but it really just sounds like it's in a fucking telephone. Mm-hmm. Kind of all like cackling in the distance, as if I had you on speakerphone. Oh. Whereas with this, it's a bit more, I don't know, it sounds better. Would oh, you know what gets, like, we should be putting effort into how we sound? Well, I'm glad it sounds better, I just don't... Are we actually recording them or Aye. <laughs> Alright, I just thought you were having a wee fucking rant before we started. No, it, like, it was just a thought, because we'd sat and done that, I thought. Oh, see, I, I feel like ignorant now, I'm going to come across as ignorant. Because I'm just like... There's mm-hmm. no change there, Craig. Fuck off. I mean, like, you remember our first episode? Vaguely. Well, you remember, like, you sounding half a robotic. No, as robotic as Stuart, but... <laughs> No. You, like, uh, I remember. I'm I remember talking about invading armies and shit like that, and you know, having a clue what the fuck I was going on about. Well, right, and, and there's the thing, uh, like, before we went to record the day, I was like, right, I'll get the paper, but the newspapers didn't steal. And, and you're lazy. Aye. <laughs> Seriously? The internet's there, we just lock stuff up on the internet. Aye, I know. When we looked up the news and all that before, I had a wee BBC News button on my Firefox, and I've not got it on this one. So I'm feeling a bit lazy myself. You should be using fucking Chrome, for starters. I don't use Chrome. Chrome is like... Oh, right, seeing the... Chrome is so 1990. Chrome is the way forward. (laughs) Chrome is open source. It's it's out on Android. It's out... Like, this is what you need. They're bringing out a Chrome OS. The problem with that being that fucking everything, like, on the laptop will be internet-based. So if you're not in a Wi-Fi zone, you're fucked, you can't do spreadsheets or Word documents or whatever. Because it's all saved to a cloud and stayed in your PC. That's a bit fucked up. Well, it saves you for carrying around an external hard drive and a bunch of pen drives, I suppose. You would need a bunch of pen drives if you're making fucking Word documents and stuff. No, but like, like, like we make podcasts, right? And now a raw episode of this is like 600 megabytes. Mm-hmm. They say I was recording at your house and then it took up to mine. Like, that would be a memory stick. And if we're recording a few episodes, you're probably talking one on each memory stick. Because I'm Did just buggering up on like a gigabyte memory stick. Lately, have you? No. <laughs> They're all one <laughs> gigabyte ones. <laughs> Aye, we're up at like fucking 32 now, Martin. Well, uh, like, I've got a 200... On, no, I've got a 180 megabyte external hard... Uh, gigabyte. Gig- Aye. Aye. External hard drive and it's just full of this. <laughs> like odd spe- like because you've got the the raw uh, wave file and that's uh. massive and then you've got like once it's edited it's doing an MP3 and then it gets mixed and that's another MP3 and like that so that's the finished version. So you get them three fucking audio files for every show and then a video file as well because it goes up on um, blip. Mhm. So it takes up a fair amount of space per episode. You say 30 gigabyte pen drives. Aye, uh, 32 or something. How much are they? I think they're like 12 quid now. For a 32 gigabyte pen drive? I think so. Man, I paid like 50 quid for, for a 1 gigabyte one. It depends what uh, brand you're buying though. Because I've got a 1 gig Philips one. I paid like 15 quid for it. Mm-hmm. But you could get like 1 gig... Uh, I don't know, Sandisk or some shit like that for like a fiver. I remember when, 
like MP3 players were first coming out. Mm-hmm. And I spent a fortune on a one with 256 megabytes of memory. Oh god, I. But it played WMAs. And so, you were so happy. Aye, because, like, if you get an iPod, it doesn't play. Like, it plays Apple style fucking things. What is it, M4A? Mm-hmm. Or whatever they are coding is, so. Aye. Like, this played different. It would play WAV files, WMA, MP3, the lot. So that was quite good back then, even though it was fucking tiny in memory. I used to fill it with all my own music, so folk would be like, what are you listening to? I'd be like, well. Well. A fun one here. Um, £20.49. For a 32 gig USB flash drive, and it's also shaped like a wee gold bar. So you've got the novelty in there, I know. You can because that gold you're carrying. No, it's the Marl Show podcast on MarlShow.com. <laughs> Every uh, uh, month, uh, bi-monthly. Are we bi month When was the last, you know? Oh, I couldn't tell you. I know we've done one, but we never put it up. I think it was just after WrestleMania, so probably... A month then, because the last paper... I just did a month. I didn't put it up. Aye. It was like... The last one was like two weeks into March or something, two or three weeks into March. I know, every time I update the website, I'm like, uh, like I'm an asshole for not updating the site more often. Because <laughs> it gets, gets like once a month. I've done it t- twice in a week and, and they, like nobody went on because I just, like, folk will check it once a month. <laughs> they know who. I found a 64 gig pen drive. Much. 75 quid. Oh, fuck. I'm p- I've no got a, I've no got like, a job or fucking like any money coming in the new at all. Like, you I'm, want one? I'm living <laughs> off my savings, right? Which is like, you hear folks saying, oh, I'm living off my savings, and it's like, like, I get a couple, like, tens of thousands of grand that the mommy mm-hmm. and daddy have gave them. I'm living <laughs> off my savings, like, fucking 90 pound in a drawer. Fuck. Hundred and twenty eight gig pen drive, hundred and forty one pound. Oh I'll I'll sell my guitars for that. <laughs> <laughs> You've got a fucking external hard drive though, you don't need one. No. Is that a pain they asked fucking carrying an external hard drive with you? No that I <laughs> don't know that I need to carry it anywhere because I'm no fucking travelling a hundred and seventy two miles in the road to fucking record with you. Two hundred and fifty six gig <laughs> pen drive. £546. Yeah, I remember when your computer had fucking 50 megabytes. Oh, God. I know. On your hard drive. And they were the old. You kind of, you get in a taxi and you hear the fucking mm-hmm. engine and it's like spanners getting dropped into a bag. Mm-hmm. The, the old hard drives used to be like that. You <coughs> Every time I wrote something. I can't even imagine having a tiny wee hard drive again. You mind the fucking floppy disks when you put a floppy disk in and then rack it and make try to read it? Oh, do you remember when I got my first PC and it, it was like meant to be a beast? It was like fucking. It was? 30, 32 meg RAM with fucking like a 4 gig hard drive and like everybody thought 4 gig hard drive, oh my god. It was massive! At the time, I mean. um, Because all the games coming out only need that 16 megabyte of RAM. <laughs> and I was I stuck with 8. I can try fucking use it though. All uh, these days. I mean, you get like, um, I mean, all your checkouts for a lot of companies and like the airports and that, they're still using PCs like that. Probably with Windows 98 because they're just using DOS for most of it. It's all simple databases and whatnot. Uh. But the, in saying that, the, like, airports are probably upgraded now, because you get Wi-Fi in airports and that now. Mm-hmm. But still, the likes are shops. In fact, when I was at uh, a Little John's restaurant, we had a, a Windows-based touch screen till... I wrote about Little John's in my fucking uh, graded unit prelim. I had to give you an example of bad business management. <laughs> <laughs> So I went with it. I think uh, making your staff cry <laughs> would be bad business management. I didn't. I didn't even mention that. I just like spoke about the lack of interaction between management and staff, and 
uh, causing conflict and duties to be duplicated and all that. So you put it off a Porsche? I have to. That's the, that's the Tory fucking candidate shining through. <laughs> I've not got a choice, man. That's what I need to do. What, vote Tory? <laughs> no, I'll fucking put it across like that.